Welcome to the page. Once again, today we are going to discuss about new topic. Yeah, before going to that, we might have observed in our daily life. If we breathe in, our chest cavity will be increased. If we breathe out, our chest cavity will be decreased. Simple thing. Behind the fit, mechanism of breathing. Today we are going to discuss about mechanism of breathing. Yeah, the structure very very important. Diaphragm is playing important role in mechanism of breathing. Diaphragm, which is a horizontal muscular layer, it is separating thoracic cavity from abdominal cavity. You see diaphragm how showing that mechanism. Inspiration and expression. These two processes were created by diaphragm that leads to mechanism of breathing. When expression occurs, when expression occurs, if you see deeply, inspiration occurs by diaphragm, you can observe when it contracts, when diaphragm contracts, you can see what happens, volume of the lungs, cavity of the lungs will be increased, space of the lungs will be increased, automatically gases which are outside coming into the lungs, that's what I am calling breathing. So, in the contraction position, gases are coming into lungs, that's what increasing in size, mostly which gas is there in it? Oxygen, very simple. So, in inspiration process, oxygen are coming, oxygen and some other gases are coming into lungs. So, increasing, what is the stage contraction which is there? Phase, of course, we are calling that is inspiration. So, when Expression occurs by diaphragm. When diaphragm relaxes, dome like structure gives, then it pushes upwards. It pushes upward to lungs are releasing gases to out. That is called breath out. When dome like structure of diaphragm is pushing upward, lungs are sending a rushing of gases. Of course, volume of the lungs will be decreased. Which gas is coming mostly to out? Carbon dioxide. The process is called expression. This is very simple. Inspiration and expression occurs by diaphragm. Diaphragm is very, very important. Room. You can observe this picture. Mechanism of breathing. So, air is entering into lungs. You can see volume of the lungs increase. Ribs and sternum rise. Volume of the thoracic cavity, uh, lungs is increased. Now diaphragm contracted. Just now I said this is called inspiration. In expiration, diaphragm will be relaxed. You can see that lungs are rushing out. Which one thing? Which thing? Gases are. So gases are going to out. Carbon dioxide is a major gas which is inside. So at the same time, ribs and sternum return to position. The process is called expiration. Volume of the thoracic cavity will be decreased. So this is mechanism of breathing. Diaphragm is working effectively to perform this breathing process. So that's what diaphragm is playing very important role in breathing process. Yeah, children. Today, my thought-provoking question: What is the role of diaphragm? If there is no diaphragm, what happens? Thank you children. Thank you so much.